Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to to episodes 19 and 20 of Love, Chino Boyo, and Other Delusions. Let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Okay, like probably the best thing ever. Hi. Why? Is it because birthday? Bronco. Like Pat to call me with that. Oh my god, <laughs> I can't. Oh Jesus, <laughs> I know, baby. It has to be her birthday. That's the only thing. Oh my god, is he good? That's a five through <laughs> Please, like, oh my god. I can't. I can't. My heart right now, I'm dying. Oh! Yeah, Cody. Oh, big boy. Big boy. <laughs> oh, oh, I got you. Are you okay? I thought you didn't fall. I got you. You're okay. You okay? Oh, you're stuck to my phone. <laughs> oh, you're okay. Thank God I caught you. You can sit in my lap a little while longer. Okay. Oh my god. <laughs> I hope it's not a camping trip. I mean, if it's a camping trip, Yeah, but aren't you in love with cumin, senpai? I know, don't you want to preserve this memory? 
Think they're like, mm. funny if this was just the whole thing for the rest of the episode. <laughs> Sonny being bored and Cuban just sleeping. <laughs> Well, she is the napping queen, of course. <clears throat> Excuse me. Mijo, so cute. You don't want to know. But it would be fair. I mean, you're on a trip together. Everything's supposed to be romantic. Oh, he 
Newton. Yeah, I get that. He's so stupid. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> she is upset. <laughs> <laughs> she a little jelly. It's a website though. I wonder what website it is. <laughs> um. <clears throat> Can't sleep. I know that feeling. Especially when you're up at 3, 4 o'clock in the morning sitting there and you want to sleep, but you're sitting there watching TikTok videos or just YouTube videos in general. <laughs> no, continue! Come on, it was good. <laughs> <clears throat>
mean, we know that they were close to kissing during the Christmas day, but no. <laughs> No, he's not kidding, unfortunately. <laughs> but he's telling the truth. Oh God, we can't. You can't do that. But I think that is like a. Oh God, it is. <laughs> Yes, that is the power of Runko using her powers. sleep in separate rooms.
<laughs> oh, what a bit more speed to just live. God, I'm dead. Like, oh, we're not even done with this freaking show for today. I mean, but oh, that was so cute. Like, I, mm, between the two, like, I really was like thinking, yes, YouTube was gonna make that first move because normally guys do, but I mean, they were so close, but because of <laughs> oh, my, here we go. Hi. I don't even know what else to say about this episode. It was so good. <laughs> I can't do. Even though it wasn't my favorite thing. Like, oh my god. It's so cute. I'm so happy. <laughs> oh. I honestly really don't have anything else to say. <laughs> I feel bad for signing still. <laughs> I mean, Sunny is just like depressed. <laughs> this girl, like, she feels so empty because Rega ain't there, and I get that because you know your your day just doesn't feel better when someone who you really care about, whether it's a close friend, um, boyfriend, girlfriend, whoever, is not around you. You feel like your day just isn't the same, and so when you're seeing that person. Um, friend, family member, whoever, close one, you know, it makes you happier. And poor baby. She might feel some type of way after <laughs> maybe 21, unless by the end of 20 they do come back. I mean, who knows? Because I don't know how long this trip is going to be for them. It could be an episode, it could be two episodes. Boy. <laughs> I mean, this girl was trying everything in her power to, like, just have a message before I get Oh, you gotta love her sometimes, though. At least she drive. You know, A for effort. That's all I gotta say. But I'm hoping that this next episode continues from the, where this episode left off. And we get to see them hang out and just, like, have another date. Because I love... My favorite episodes in animes, mostly, are really just the date episodes. I think they're, like, the most cutest things. And having the two main leads, like, interact with each other, whether it's just walking around, going out to eat, going into, like, just somewhere fun, and just being themselves, and <laughs> doing stupid stuff together. I mean, those are, like, the best episodes, and a lot of shows that I've watched from the past have just not had, like, done amazing date episodes, and like I said, still one of my personal favorites is, like, the Monogatari episodes, and how those were just so good, and plus, like, the two episodes they did, they did the date episodes are two things that, like, they did two things that I really would love to do in a relationship, and especially, like, one of them, if I ever go to Japan, whether it's, it, whether it's a date or not, or if it's just, like, with a family member, like, if my mom goes with me, I'm still going there, and it's gonna be the best freaking time ever, I don't care, I will literally just be like, mom, take me, take a picture of this, take a picture of that, take a picture of me doing anything! <laughs> Honestly, but no matter what it is, it's about having fun, and I'm glad that these two were having fun together, because I imagine, like, the, the first part of this episode, I mean, she, yeah, she was embarrassed, he was embarrassed, and I'm just like, yeah, you feel that, and I'm just like, hmm, like, no, now they're just finally alone, and they can do cuddly things, and I can't, my heart, but 
But yeah, go ahead and pause the video and I'll see you guys in one second for episode 20. Alrighty, episode 20 in 3, 2, 1, go. Rain for you. This might be like, mm, I don't know, will this probably be a better episode than the Monogatari days? I I mean, come on, like, I, I kind of sometimes when I'm bored, I compare dates, episodes to other date episodes, so I don't know how this is gonna go! Really! But still, like I said, Monogatari days are, like, number one in my book. I think, like, the car cap to Sakura, like, regular and clear car dates are, like, second to me because I love that series so freaking much, and especially when I did reactions on it, that was, like, probably, besides Kimono Friends, um, I would say, like, for big, big views that I got, it was between those two, because, I mean, I'm not gonna cry again. Also, you think Sophia would be there with Dekomani and everyone? <laughs> Yeah, you're the one who called her. Oh, we talking about that. the piece of paper that you got in the last episode.
Yeah, they're technically on a date. Oh, when people lose the person. But how? Wait, me go. Or you maybe just go to the lost and found. No, I don't think she did. So someone else knows about you. Maybe self need it. But still, it could be in here right now. Beautiful. Oh, no! <laughs> no. <clears throat> you gotta be really careful. But you left me
You know, I hate to say it, but like ever since Soph has come in, she's been the third wheel. And so it, it's awkward. It's cute at times, but it's awkward. And it's just like, oh my God, you want to just give her a hint. You just feel so bad for me. But also, YouTube's a big idiot for doing things. But you know, he's a nice guy. Exactly. Why? Besides, he can talk to her. I'm just apologize. Hmm? Heck, it would be funny if they were staying at the same hotel. I'm gonna go apologize to you, don't you? Gonna call me again. Oh. <laughs> And that's self sent you the picture of the map as well. Mm, he just getting chewed out. <laughs> Just the talk. I 
really adorable. Huh? Oh. That's okay. I fell for him too. Here. He's too cute. Even though you still can't find it. Well, she just left. It's so cute. My color.
<laughs> okay. That was cute. Like, stop. Oh my god. Even though, okay. Mm. I will say, like, okay. The previous date that they had a couple episodes ago. I love that one a lot more than this one. It was only because Soph came in and kind of ruined it. I still love Soph. I think she's a very interesting character. But, you know, you gotta know when you're third wheeling. Like, mm, I, I, you know, been in that situation with a friend and then a guy's there. And I'm just like, yeah, I, I just need to go. It, it feels so awkward. I mean, yes, a guy and a girl can be friends without it being, you know, a relationship and ish, but sometimes, you know, you get those feelings and you're like, I, I know what this is. Let me get the F up out of here before, like, I get chewed out. I didn't really get chewed out with my friend, but it kind of, um, we, we had, I think that was like our first argument over, um, and, mm, it was stupid. I didn't even, like, I didn't like him. We were just friends, me and him, but the other two was like hit or miss and ish. But yeah, it was a cute episode. Like, oh my god. It's just, uh, I'm happy that they were able to work it out. Soph and Rika explaining and talking and ish. Because sometimes that's the only thing that you can do is freaking talk to someone and tell them, hey, it wasn't like this. It's never like this. Yes, I truly had feelings for him, but not anymore. He's with you and. I know that I can never be with him because of that, but still cute. It's just like every other freaking series, like freaking Hanahi or um, Bunny Girl Senpai or freaking, um, not Izzy or Rebel, what the freak, uh, the Teenage Nafu show and where it's one guy and a bajillion girl sometimes and we already know whoever the first person that he meets, like that's the love interest for him. But then other girls come in and then, like, there is some romantic-esque thing with them. And then he has to choose, but he's already picked who he wants to be with. Like, with Bunny Girl Senpai, you mean it's best girl Mai? And then when what's her face, like, oh, God, I don't remember her name because it's been a while since I watched <laughs> Bunny Girl Senpai. Um, where she told him he she had feelings for him and unfortunately she had he had to reject her or like in Monogatari when my, one of my best girls. <laughs> oh my god, mm. this is bringing back a lot of feelings when you're watching an anime and you just oh the heartbreaking moments and you just like mm. you can't reciprocate those feelings because they're in love with someone else and just mm, that heartbreak the worst thing ever I mean but still you're like everybody's gonna find someone and just mm, they're out there you just gotta find them you're gonna kiss a lot of frogs before you find your prince your princess whoever and it's just that's all like not everybody's just gonna be like on that same level with you and that's okay you just gotta move on and sometimes in the end you have to love yourself first before you go into a freaking relationship because next thing you know, like, they've shipped you away and you feel like you're a complete shell of what you once were. And then, who knows? But this is a good episode. I loved it. It was good. I just, that third wheel, that third wheel, though, I mean, mm -hmm, you just gotta know. And I'm glad that she kind of figured it out, but mm -hmm, it's kind of a little too late, but yeah. Other than that, guys, that was my reaction to Futures episodes 19 and 20 of Love, Chino, Boyo, and the Other Delusions. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially on next Friday for Patreons and next Monday for Rails for episodes 21 and 22. Bye, guys.